hi Sagittarius welcome into my channel thank you so much for being here I appreciate your presence so I'm presenting readings for Sagittarius Sun Moon rising and Venus sign Sagittarius you are the ninth astrological sign of the zodiac your symbol is the archer your ruling planet is Jupiter your symbol I mean your element is fire fire Sagittarius so let's get started with your reading I hope that these messages really resonate with you and you find healing and guidance for your journey so let us get started Sagittarius please go ahead and focus your divine intention on this deck of card here so that I can present you with the most accurate readings for your week ahead your seven day forecast let us see what's coming up in Sagittarius's energy Saji, what's going on? Saji? Okay. I feel like maybe there's an earth sign that's in your heart space. Earth sign. Taurus, Virgo, Capricorn. There's water sign too. I feel like this earth sign has love for you or you have love for this earth sign. Could be a soulmate energy where both of you are on the same level emotionally. You feel the same way about things, <clears throat> about money perhaps. You and this person maybe finish each other's sentences. Sagittarius, so you're in your element, you're feeling good. You could be connecting with a water sign, maybe moving away from or wanting to move away from an earth sign to a water sign. To a place where you can find more value in yourself value pentacles money <clears throat> thank you for giving me these wonderfully accurate messages for Sagittarius the general reading for Sagittarius for in this hour thank you so much for coming through thank you so much Messages for Sagittarius. Messages for Sagittarius, please. Clear messages for Sagittarius energy in this time. Thank you so much for coming through. Queen of Pentacles here. the page of cups a message coming in of love something having to do with your emotional balance stability an offer of love perhaps and a reward and an, um, a gesture of gratitude for something that you're doing maybe you're a financial advisor people are looking for you to for guidance financially how to stay grounded how to be find value within themselves Sagittarius how to feel happy and outgoing how to remain vibrant yes vibrancy you could be getting some kind of a message from a water sign if there's a water sign within your family however it is for you some messages coming in to you you're represented here Sagittarius as the Queen of Pentacles getting your money together Really focus on your on building your empire, your wealth, your bank account. I feel like this message you're coming in is something that you deserve. So it could be a good message for you. I feel like you get these kind of kinds of messages a lot. And I'm thinking like messages of income coming into you. But it has to do, it's something that has to do with your emotions on a wider sense, Sagittarius. So this message will bring some kind of a balance into your life. Helping you to go forward to where you need to be. Okay, Sagittarius, let's clarify the Queen of Pentacles. Thank you so much for being here. Um, thank you so much for being present in this reading. Let's get some real divine messages out for you guys now. What's going on with the Queen of Pentacles here in Sagittarius reading? What is this saying? 
the six of cups an offer of love perhaps i feel like someone is looking at you and you look glorious elegant you are financially stable you're a leader you have your own business so you're an entrepreneur and i feel you could also be reminiscing about love from the past so even though you you have a financial you have financial stability in your life sagittarius you're reminiscing somehow about maybe a past person that you love or loved or that loved you whatever you know just take it as it resonates with you so you're enough yes i feel like you're reminiscing could be a water sign that you're thinking about because we have the page of cups over here representing water sign as well cancer scorpio pisces so if you have any person like that in your life you could be thinking of them an old love before you went off to work on your dreams and your money maybe there was a person that loved you so much you know showed you so many different acts of kindness is the most purest realest love that you've experienced all right, let's clarify the page of cups for your energy Sagittarius what is this energy and offering a message coming into you possibly from a water sign Pisces Scorpio cancer possibly an earth sign as well that is coming with their heart on their sleeves wearing their emotions just coming to you expressing themselves so possibly an earth sign coming into you and a water sign so that's the possibility we have the king of swords no, this is strange. Could this be someone that you blocked coming back? A message from your past person. See? Could be someone from your past because your back is turned to this person here. That you're you're pro probably thinking about them or they're thinking about you. But I feel like you're thinking about this person, Sagittarius. I feel like you blocked this person out of your life. And they may be finding another way to reach out to you. okay let's see what happens all right Sagittarius let's look at the justice card here and see what its message is for you coming up in the week what does the justice card saying in Sagittarius is reading the seven of wands conflict having had to fight it could have been with paperwork so a business idea that some justice was served over this justice because you did have the upper hand in the situation and so you did come out on top it could be something that has to do with finances so i might be speaking in the past tense i feel but this is what is coming up for you this is what is coming up for you so i feel like you are already financially stable you're working on your money strongly but now you're thinking of someone from your past that is possibly thinking of you as well so let's get this out who is this past person that you're thinking of or what is coming up what is this really saying oh my gosh the three of swords the three of swords no normally represents a broken heart betrayal someone that caused you pain and maybe that's why you blocked this person out of your life why are they coming back now they're looking at you looking good justice coming back with justice back to by justice as if they have a point to prove to you so look out for that message whatever it is that they have to say to you they broke your heart but you picked your i feel like you picked yourself up and you made your burdens to to light you transmuted the energy and you started to work on yourself you started to dream of a better love connection i feel so maybe while you're dreaming up a brand new beautiful love this person is seeing you glowing because you know the thoughts your thoughts actually at, um, affect how your your characters look your, your external appearance is so you may be smiling sometimes just feeling good feeling that passion in, ignited within you for this new love that you're dreaming up this kind of energy because from the hurt we are able to create what it is that we really want out of life so you're like i don't want someone that hurts me i want someone that takes me out cares for me caresses me treats me well someone that i love someone that i love to be around that i can be there for have a strong com connection to 
maybe we meet each other well emotionally we know how to cater to each other's emotions we know how we feel even before speaking and both of us are grounded feeling that we have healed we're both working on our businesses that's so i feel like you're you're really manifesting that kind of love after having a, an experience where you felt trapped with someone that hurt you and i, I feel like this is so i you see i'm saying you started to really pick up yourself after this i'm so happy and proud of you you picked up yourself you maybe started working out started focusing more on your business growing your pentacles started feeling really proud of yourself and just graduating into the queen of pentacles energy here amazing beautiful beautiful so no broken heart can get you down what was this okay so let us clarify the page of cups here for Sagittarius who's reading what's who is this person is this a past person coming back with an offer what offer and we know why they were blocked right the eight of swords swiftly coming in words written i feel like someone is writing you a message <laughs> but you have this person blocked you have this person blocked they're writing you a message they want to come in to you swiftly with all these things to say as if they they feel justified in it they have a point to prove they they have their they have to state their claim or clear their name or something but it's a message of love and they're coming in swiftly they possibly did break your heart okay let us move on clarifying the justice card and the seven of swords here what's coming up for sagittarius um, let's see this five of swords hmm. okay i feel like you really had to defend yourself against this person three of swords broken hearts it caused you to set new boundaries within yourself this person could be coming with the intention to be triumphant with you also to win you back to clear something up i feel maybe they feel like they have unfinished business with you so we'll see what they're coming with feeling like they're guided by their intuition like i have to do this okay but i don't really trust oh gosh there's something where i don't really trust their energy because I feel like there could be two people in your life one that is able to cater for your emotions be able to stand by you match your vibration and one that you're somehow attached to that wants that wants to i feel like they come back in when they are ready to and then they exit and that's why you had to block them and they might be coming again and your heart yes you worked on your self-love you healed but i feel like the swords there's still more healing to do so this person coming through to you you know unless they're coming to soothe you i don't see this there's an energy of it not being too serious the energy that they're coming with is not something ready they're not ready why are they coming with the justice card if they're not ready as if they decided they chose like, this feels like a game like it's a game to this person like they ugh, like they have two options and they chose you to come after you i don't know if the other option left them went away from them did something cut them out caused them to want to up their standards as well and that's why they're choosing to come back to you wanting to say what I've changed <laughs> I have changed justice give me another chance possibly that's what it is give me a chance I've changed 
I've, I've left some people behind. I've cut them out and I'm choosing you. So I'm coming with justice on my side. I'm choosing. I'm choosing. I've, I've been dealing with this for a long time and I've thought about it and I'm choosing you. Okay. Alright. Wandsy, wandsy pentacles. <laughs> yes, yes, yes. So this person did cause you pain, broken heart. You may have felt lost with this person here. I'm saying we're talking about a water sign, possibly, you know. Cancer, Pisces, or Scorpio. The Ace of Wands. The Ace of Pentacles. Look at, okay. So it was that healing. You tending to your pentacles. It's as if you got a certain inclination to really tend to your money. Take your focus off of what is hurting you and focus on what you can control, which is your money. You got that sense of what that of being able to control this aspect of your life and it caused you to really overcome pain from the past the king of wands i feel like this is saying that this person is hurt possibly this person that you're dealing with coming back from me to you they too have traumas and pains they they're not healed either they feel or they feel tormented without you so they're coming into you with an offer they know that you have blocked them they they may be trying to find another way digging up some other way to come into you with this offer here financial stability what are they offering you sex so they're offering you money and good loving that's the message that they're going to send I, oh i'm so passionate about you and uh i can't stop thinking about you i can't sleep at night dreaming about you and two i see you're doing so good you're looking so good over there you know working on your pentacles so even though you blocked me, I had to come in and say hi. I had to write you this message. I honestly don't know if this money belongs to this person. What is this? As if they're looking at you, feeling tormented, wanting some loving or something. I feel like they're paying someone to do something. They're, they're giving out money. They could be paying a lawyer a police officer a person that writes contracts to get to uh i was saying they're looking up looking you up you could be paying someone to get to find some information about you so that they can message you that's what they did but i feel like their energy is not that deeply connected now if you want that energy that is great you know that's great for you but it's just what i'm feeling in myself that this person is not coming to be serious not they're they're not in their you know that driven commitment that i want this they might say it with passion but at the same time they don't really feel it because the next if anything happens they're going to jump out again because they are afraid of commitment they're not they don't know how to really commit they are mostly ruled by their sexual desires, I'm afraid to say. But I just have to. Like, maybe you're the best thing that has ever happened to this person. You're the light of their life. And they messed up and hurt you. And now they want to come in with this, this little cup. Not, not the best of themselves, you know. Not the, not the king of cups. But this little offering. Ooh, it feels like breadcrumbs offering. And you're like... I don't want to cuss, but the energy is getting intense. But you're like, really? It's, look look what you decided to do with your money. Spend it over here, getting people to find out more information about me. Trying to impress me with this little offer here. And I'm focusing over here on my money. And this is what you're coming to me with. 
look at you like you need to level up yourself I, you know it sounds harsh but it, it's a reality you know it's a reality the things that we have to face people do these things in life okay i'm going to leave your messages here get a little bit from the playing cards any messages for sagittarius thank you so much welcome sagittarius in man let's welcome them in with some beautiful messages sagittarius welcome in no i'm not taking this as yet maybe you can repeat it thank you so much Sagittarius for being here I hope that these messages have been resonating with you I'm going to do a recap of your reading just after getting these messages from the playing cards the ten of swords this is done the ten is the ending the new beginning of something you're looking for something you're not you're not looking behind what's coming what these people behind you are doing this could be a fire sign aries leo sagittarius this could be you <laughs> so just really take the messages as they resonate with you could be reading in reverse thank you so much for messages for sagittarius in this reading who is this page of cups what are they coming with say again this is what they're coming with words text messages to speak to you wanting to they see your new beginnings they see you shining that is the ten of pentacles amazing vibration amazing energy of wealth abundance success prosperity beautiful family life this is the six of cup repeating cups repeating itself again you loving yourself inside out you knowing what you deserve out of this life and you're waiting to manifest your twin your soulmate energy you know you deserve that come through sagittarius not that not that one i didn't feel it <sighs> tell us more what's going on what's coming up for you thank you so much okay one more all right appreciate you coming through thank you so much for stopping by my channel for your messages i hope that they resonate with you and you'll be coming back for other readings remember subscribe to my channel to stay updated on when i send out new videos with new messages all right thank you so much for being here all the best to you and what good Oh, I did promise a recap. Okay, cool. Yeah. So the recap is you went through some sort of a broken heart with a person that you felt betrayed you. They did. I can see that here. You got the guidance to really focus on your pentacles, focus on your sense of self-worth, loving yourself, working on your self-love, doing um practicing self-love, eating well, exercising, meditating, writing out your feelings, really healing your body. You started to work on your pentacles and they grew and now you're financially strong, stable, independent. I feel like your person from the past who could be a water sign or a fire sign, Aries, Leo, Sagittarius, Capricorn, Pisces, Pisces, Scorpio, could be coming into you with an offer, with a message, sending you written messages, of how much they were thinking um of you are working working toward this getting better for you they've been working on themselves which feels like they were just having terrible nights couldn't sleep and thinking of you and they may have paid someone to do research about you or to write some kind of a contract or something regarding you but you're not paying this any attention it's not really affecting your life right now but expect something like this to come up for you you are now focusing on your future on manifesting your twin flame on staying focused in your purpose your new beginnings of wealth health and happiness that's your message thank you so much bye